Absolute fucking shit. It's because I'm sick right now again. I was sick uh, yesterday, uh, Saturday, Friday, and then Saturday I was fine, and then today I'm not really feeling good. So sorry if I sound like fucking shit. But I want to talk about this one YouTuber who makes shorts, and the YouTuber's name is uh, like Tony or something. Their at is like Tony something something. Basically. This YouTuber, or this dude, he found this kid named Timmy on the beach. Or, at least according to his video, he found a kid named Timmy on the beach. I'm not even sure if that's a kid's real name. But I don't really want to know the kid's real name, because that's weird. But basically, then that kid went missing for like two weeks, and eventually, you know, the dude who found him on the beach called the police. Like, hey, this kid is missing, we need to get him back. Eventually they found him, and then, uh, a few days later, he goes to, uh, the kid's school. He somehow finds the kid's school and impersonates his dad, Timmy's dad, to pick him up from school and make him miss school. And then eventually he said, while doing, like, a TikTok live, some dude in the Home Depot was trying to give him a paper. An envelope or something, and he thought it was a joke, so he just left. And then while he was doing, like, a TikTok live, he got a restraining order against him from Timmy's parents. And that was the right thing to do. Because, one, this dude literally stalked the kid, basically, to know where he goes to school. Two, he literally impersonated his dad. And three... He basically purchased the fucking kid. Because I saw a short about the kid, and basically, he called the kid's, like, actual dad, I think. It's probably a lie, but basically, I think he called the kid's actual dad. And basically said, hey, I'll give you a lot of money for... Basically, what he said is, oh, I have a really good fishing spot. And also, uh, and also, um... Um, him, I'll give you a bunch of money for your kid's college fund. So basically, he bribed the dad into making him bring his son so he could see him. So, hmm, what did he do? Basically, he kidnapped the kid by impersonating his dad. And then, he literally bribed the Timmy's actual dad... So that way he would lift the restraining order. And also, isn't it with a restraining order, you're not supposed to contact the person or their family at all? Meaning he was breaking or disobeying, or like he was doing something with the restraining order he was not supposed to? Basically, a restraining order is basically like, oh, you can't go near the person. Basically, whoever puts it against you or on you, Basically, it means that, like, oh, whoever you were going near that you're not supposed to, you can't go near them, basically. Or at least that's what I think. I don't really know what a restraining order is. I might have to do some more research on that. But basically, the dude, he's like, it's not fair that I have to have a restraining order against me. And then I looked at the comments of the video... And all of them, most of them basically said, it's the right thing for him... Sorry for my phone battery being so low, but basically, a lot of the comments said, it's restraining order is the right call. Because a lot of the comments are like, he literally stalked, kidnapped this kid, so that way he could see him. I mean, I get it, the kid had fun with the guy, but like, you can't just be like, oh, I want to have, I want to hang out with a kid, let me just stalk them and find out where they go to school and then kidnap them. Like, bro, that is not okay. But basically, that dude's like, oh, it's okay to kidnap kids, guys. Now, I'm not endorsing kidnapping or anything like that. Please don't do that. That can get you in big trouble. But basically, please do not harass the YouTuber I mentioned in this video because I don't want him to get hate just because I talked about him. Just because I talked about him in a video. Please do not go harass him. 
because a lot of people in his comments already kind of dislike him anyways. Please don't go harass him or hurt him just because I said he did all these terrible things. And if you really want to see them for yourself, I may actually find a shorts with the kid in it and then link them in the description. Or find the links to them. But the problem with shorts now is you can't even see the description of the shorts anymore. Like, you can't see what day they were exactly made. So it means you literally have to go off the comments to see how long ago the short was made. Basically, that was it for this video. I really hope you enjoy. And please, oh please, do not harass the dude I mentioned. Because if you do, I will probably be held responsible. And I don't want him to get harassed just because I talked about horrible things he did. Anyways, that's going to be about it, so bye. I'm so sorry for my disgusting voice. <laughs>